Okay, so let's have this one, the trapezoid. So these are the properties of a trapezoid. So the parallel sides of a trapezoid creates the basis. Since this is the parallel side, so therefore these are the bases. So we have the base 1 and the base 2. Then the sum of the interior angles of a trapezoid equals 360 degrees. And these are the interior angles. So therefore, angle A plus angle B plus angle C plus angle D is equal to 360 degrees. Then the angles on each side of the trapezoid are supplementary or that's equal to 180 degrees. So angle A plus angle C, that's equal to 180 degrees. And also this angle B plus angle D also equal to 180 degrees. Then the median of a trapezoid is the line that connects the midpoint of the two legs. So these are the legs of a trapezoid. So we have this, the leg 1 and the leg 2. And this is the median. So this line EF is equal to the midsection of the trapezoid. And these are the different formulas to remember for a trapezoid. So to solve for the area, that's the base 1 plus the base 2 times the height divided by 2. Then to solve for the height of the trapezoid, that's a leg 1 times sine angle A or leg 2 times sine angle B or using the area formula to solve for the height, that's 2 times the area divided by the sum of base 1 and the base 2. Then to solve for the midsection of a trapezoid, so we have the base 1 plus the base 2, then divide by 2. So we have this uh, problem, so in a trapezoid MNOP, so measures of angle O, that's 110 degrees, and for angle M, that's 5X plus 25, then find X and the measures of angle M. Now since in a trapezoid, the angles on each side of a trapezoid are supplementary, so therefore this angle M plus angle O is equal to 180 degrees. So substitute the value of angle M, that's 5X plus 25, plus angle O, that's 110 degrees, that's equal to 180 degrees. Then to solve for x, so we have this 5x equals 180. Then this 25 plus 110, this one is 135. Then transpose to the right, that becomes negative 135. So 5x now equals 180 minus uh, 135. This one is 45. So to solve for x, divide both sides by 5. So x is equal to 9. Then to solve now for the measure of angle M, so we have this 5x plus 25. But since x is equal to 9, so we have now 5 times 9 plus 25. Then this 5 times 9, that's 45. And 45 plus 25. So angle M now is equal to 70 degrees. Then for this problem, so in a trapezoid WXYZ, where WX is parallel to YZ, so therefore these are uh, the bases, and B is the median, so measure of uh, line WX, that's 26, so this one is 26. And for line YZ, that's 34, so this one is 34. Then solve for this line AB. Since the formula for the midsection of trapezoid, that's base 1 plus base 2 over 2. So we have now uh, 26 plus 34, then divide by 2. Then this 26 plus 34, this one is 60. 
then divide by 2. So therefore, this line AB or the midsection of trapezoid is equal to 30 centimeters. Then for this problem, so one of the bases of trapezoid is 5 meters longer than the other. Find the length of the two bases if the median is 10 meters. Now, since uh, the longer base is 5 meters longer, and this one is the longer base, so therefore this one is x plus 5, and the shorter base, that's x. Then since the median is 10 meters, so this one is 10. So to solve for uh, the length of the two bases, using this midsection of trapezoid, that's uh, base 1 plus base 2 divided by 2. Since the midsection of trapezoid is equal to 10, so we have now 10 equals B1, that's X, plus the base 2, that's X plus 5, then divide by 2. Then simplify, so we can use cross multiplication. So we have this 10 times 2, this one is 20. Then X plus X, that's 2X, then plus 5. So to solve for x, so transpose this 5 to the left, so that becomes negative, then that's equal to 2x, then this 20 minus 5, this one is 15, so to solve for x, divide both sides by 2, so x now is equal to 7.5. Since x is equal to 7.5, so therefore the base 1 is equal to x or 7.5 meters and for the base 2 so that's x plus 5 so the 7.5 plus 5 so the base 2 now is 12.5 meters so these are the length of the two bases of this trapezoid then for this problem so find the area of the given trapezoid so formula for the area that's base 1 plus base 2 times the height divided by 2. So we have now base 1, that's 12. Then a base 2, that's 18. And the height, that's 9. Then divide by 2. Then this uh, 12 plus 18. This one is 30 times 9 divided by 2. Then 30 times 9. This one is 270. Then divide by 2. So the area now of this trapezoid is 135 centimeters squared.